fun stuff. Today we have this magnet pendulum with these two chairs. We're going to see how high it has to be for it to track these metal um, pieces. So here we go. Pump, pump. First, you see right now it's not attracting. And we'll see how much inches this is. So like I said, it's not attracting because we have a magnet here. And it's trying to attract these metal pieces. And like I said, it's hung by a pendulum here with these two chairs. So let's get it back here. So as you see, the magnet is not attracting the metal pieces. We'll see how high it is. It's right now about five inches. So what we're going to do is we're just going to move the chairs a bit closer. So this gets down, and right now it is at now just a little bit more. It's at four inches, and it's not attracting. So we're gonna go down by an inch. One second, just like this, three inches. So let's just shake it. Yes, and it's not even influencing this to make it go this side or another. So. Okay, two inches is our next stop. Three right now, then let's just bring it back closer. Right there, two inches. Now the question is, will it be able to move it from side to side? Oh, these two are attracting. Let's watch for a minute. Yes, and nothing, so. Let's go down half an inch this time because we're getting closer to hitting the table. So, one and a half inches. And look, it's moving it. It is now influencing this. Let's just move. And I think it's going too fast now. Let's just stop it and put it right here. Put this up and see that influence. Now, because we have this influence, let's go down a quarter of an inch. Which may be hard, but I think that's about there. So, an influence, but no attraction. Let's go down to one inch. That's an automatic one. Let's just put this down and then just swing it, see? Can it pick up anything here? Not picking up anything. I think because as it goes, it's going higher and higher. So what we'll do is we'll move it till it's touching the ground. Yes, it should attract. And, oh, yes. So we don't want it touching the ground. We just step it above the ground like this and then swing it. Whoa. And then it just takes everything. We'll go a bit higher. Okay. Oh, there we go. Let's get this, let's get this out because it's so thick and just leave these alone. So then you'll have a harder time. Uh-oh. Oh, there are two, 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 and that's three. Let's stop that there. That was weird because what happened is this came on. Then this came on attracting to this. And this came on attracting to this. No, no, sorry. This came on attracting that, yes. And this came on attracting to both of these. And this came on at the end. I believe really how it went. Let's go a bit higher. Oh, that's way too high. And, and, and no, no. Nothing still, oh, a touch. Oh, another touch. Oh. And uh, let's spin it a bit more. And that's too low, too, too, too low. So let's find the perfect spot. Okay, let's try it again. It's not moving. No. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's that. It's not an attraction. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh! 
That's a way too big of a load. It's going down. Let's see if this will help. Yes, that is helping. So the thing is, having this on the end is helping. So then that can touch other things. Yeah. So that is helping. So try this at home. Have fun. Um, leave a like to this video. Click the bell icon. Subscribe to the fun stuff. And thanks for watching. See ya. Pew, pew, pew.